y'all good morning so it's uh friday morning it's just me and drew and we're gonna damn uh we got about four that we're gonna do uh not a big deal uh you know roughly uh about about 390 dollars man uh, we'll be done we should be done around it's 9 20 now uh i gotta get fuel uh, I'm waiting at, waiting at the gas pumps here. So. Look at this truck in front of me. has got everything blocked in. But, uh, yeah, so Bo called me this morning from the coffee shop down here he's on he's on got back down here to sonoa you know i don't know how this like where this lady's going oh, she's gonna go out that way but uh he called from the coffee shop from somebody's phone and then he texted me and I just, I just texted back, just said, no phone, no work, man. I, I, I'm not, it ain't hardly worth it to me, man, to keep, to keep doing all that, man. There ain't enough work out here, man. So, you know, it's easy for me to damn say no, you know. You, know, you should prepare your money better, you know. All I can say. So, yeah. All right, guys, so uh, we got done. It's only 12 o'clock, man, and we did about 380 bucks in about three hours. So, you know, me and Drew, so, uh, you know, that's that's not bad. You know, it's not great. Uh, main thing I'm trying to do is just keep my expenses down and, uh, you know, uh, and, and keep Drew, uh, you know, money coming. So we could have done, I know, and people say, well, man, you only work about three hours. Well, but I'm budgeting my work. Just like people budget their money, I'm budgeting my work, uh, uh, you know, and, and picking and choosing what jobs we do uh, and all of that uh, and making sure that we just got enough work to where uh, Drew can get paid and I'm not having to take a hit. So... Uh, yeah so uh this morning uh when we were getting gas oh bo uh bo was up at the up at the gas station well he can't go on the premises of the gas station but he was up there wanting work uh and uh he texted he called me this morning you know from you know wanting work you know and you know i i, I really don't even need him uh uh right now you know uh I mean, I really don't even know what to really do about, you know, uh, about him and all that, man. Uh, because I really ain't trying to, you know, I, I don't I don't have enough work to justify having Bo out here. The, the biggest thing with this year, as, as different to any other year I've been in business, is this year I'm having to think a little bit different because I am uh, paying somebody throughout the winter. I never have done that before. I've never committed to pay anybody throughout the winter. But I have learned uh, in the years that I've been doing this uh, that if I want to hit the ground running in the spring, that I need to uh, be able to pay somebody through the winter so I don't have to. Because it seems like every year, you know, uh, up until, you know, now, is that every spring i have to reinvent the wheel i have to train somebody else i have to hire somebody you know and all of that and you know uh i don't want to do that man because that really takes away from the earning potential you know for the summer uh big time i mean it ain't a little it, it, because it takes some it, it takes a while to teach somebody uh you know everything that we do out here and you know from uh what the customer wants and and likes for each uh, you know each customer and to you know where to park at and uh what mower setting to be on and 
you know, all those things. So, you know, it's not uh, as easy as a lot of people may think, you know. So, uh, yeah, uh, just got to, and, and I'm going into, into, into uncharted territory, so I don't know either, you know, uh, the best way to do this, you know, uh, only thing I know is 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 the numbers. You know, I, I know that today we did three hundred and eighty dollars. It's twelve twelve fifteen and we started about nine thirty uh and we did three hundred and eighty dollars and I got, you know, forty in fuel, uh a uh, hundred to Drew, uh and uh the rest uh, just goes in the business account. So, you know, I don't know what, what kind of profit margin I made today, uh, but I know that I have work for next week, too. And if I, I yeah, true enough, we could have went on and done, you know, six or seven hundred dollars today. And then Monday I'd be struggling to find something that, for us to do. So uh, I'm just, you know, and, I, and you guys can comment and, and please let me know what, what, what you guys think. Uh, you know, because I don't know, man. Uh, I just want to. I just want to make sure Drew gets gets what he needs to get to pay his bills, so I don't have to. So he don't have to go find another job through the winter. Uh, yeah. So uh, because as a business owner, you know, uh, uh, I got I, I banked my money all summer, and uh, so I got money in the bank that I can live uh, live on until spring i mean and still probably be okay because a lot of my bills are paid already up until april so you know my biggest bills are paid uh in advance like my house note is paid until april so i don't owe another house note until april 1st uh and you know uh, but everybody you know the guys that work for me of course that their their money uh, they don't make as much money as i make as the business makes so you know i have to be aware of that if i'm gonna you know have guys and try to keep them through the winter and all that and and like i said you know this is something that i have never done before so you know there's a lot that i don't know and uh and i'm gonna learn and i'm learning now uh, uh normally you know like if I like if I wasn't worried about having work next week and Drew wasn't you know on board, I would have had Bo out here today, and me and Bo would have done five or six hundred dollars worth. I'd have gave Bo his cut, and then we might not work for three days, you know. Uh, yeah, uh, but uh, having Drew out here and trying to you know. Uh, keep him on all winter to make sure he can pay his bills at the end of the day that's really all i care about because i can pay my bills it doesn't matter what happens i can pay my bills i could give drew a salary and i can still pay my bills but from a business standpoint uh, uh i want to be able to generate money before i start giving money away just to keep somebody on staff now i will do that you know but if i can generate uh some of that money at least then that's a better business for me, you know, uh, at least I'm earning and not having to uh, just go straight up and pull, you know, $300 out or whatever uh, to give to a guy that uh, hasn't had to work, you know. Uh, as long as Drew is able to help me generate, doesn't have to help me generate a whole lot of money, but just help me generate enough to cover his pay and to cover my expenses where I don't have to go into my... Uh, savings and pull money out uh for labor i'll do that to keep drew on board you know and i'll do that to keep drew on board uh but uh if i don't have to then i then i want you know i won't do that uh but i'm curious as to what you guys would do if you were me and uh you trying to keep a guy on for the for the winter and all that uh a lot of you guys are saying you know uh the bobcat needs to needs to to be running more uh to generate money you know and you're right i got a few uh 
Yeah, and I got and I got a few jobs uh, that the Bobcat is uh, is going to be doing, but uh, probably nothing before Christmas or before the New Year. Uh, we'll see after this weekend. I got a, a job to do, but well, I got a job to do. I got a job that we're going to go bid on and meet with the lady. She's a regular customer of mine, so I know I'm pre I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the work. It's just a matter of uh, us talking about money and timing and all. She may tell me, hey, you know, let's do it after the new year. Uh, so I can think of right now, as we sit in here right now, uh, and uh, these ain't people that I don't know. I got uh, three Bobcat jobs right now uh, uh, slated for January. Now, sometimes, you know, a lot of things can change, but these are customers that are my regular customers that I know and uh and and i got three jobs that'll probably pay a total of you know uh, you know 5k you know something like that so uh the trick for me is just to keep drew busy enough to where he can get his bills paid and to keep me stay busy enough to where I don't have to, you know, uh, pull money out of an account that I don't want to do. I can do it, and I will do it if I have to. But, you know, for me, right now, today, this week, this month, I don't have to put, I don't have to put Drew on a salary right now uh, because uh, uh, every day that because i got I'm, I'm generating enough work to cover my expenses and to cover drew's pay you know i might not be getting paid out of out of some of it or if i am it's very little by the time i pay all the expenses but i'm okay uh because all my bills got to be paid no matter either way uh so if i don't pull a, a salary between now and you know for me between now and, and New Year's, I'm perfectly okay with that as long as I can pay Drew. So I don't, I don't really know if that's the right way to do it, man. Uh, <sighs> good, yawning. I know, man. These, a day like today is just, I mean, it's so pretty out. It's just beautiful, man. It just makes me want to lay down somewhere. Anyway, y'all, I'm going to go inside and uh, eat me a Sammy and... Uh, grateful for another day out here uh being my own boss and in control of everything uh it's ray peace out